Excitement is building as we get closer to Super Bowl Sunday. Raymond James Stadium in Tampa is all decked out for the big game. But the celebration looks and feels a little bit different this year. Bars and restaurants around Tampa Bay are under local mandates to limit crowds and enforce social distancing. As the Bucks and Chiefs take the field, there will be 25,000 fans in attendance and 30,000 cutouts. Among the limited fans in attendance, a group of frontline health care workers with ties to Charlotte. Yeah, 10 friends and doctors who all trained at Atrium Health Carolina's Medical Center will be at the big game in Tampa on Sunday. It's been a tradition for the group to watch the Super Bowl together since 2002, and this year they'll all get to see it in person for free. WCNC Charlotte's Kendall Morris shows how the annual tra tradition is continuing continuing amid one of the most challenging years of their careers. For this group of friends, their love of medicine brought them together as interns at Carolina's Medical Center. But it's their love of sports that's reunited them year after year since graduation. We sort of picked the Super Bowl, one, because it's not a typical family obligation type date, but two, we we bonded over football. Every year, the group of physicians gets together to watch the big game, their tradition growing with their careers and families. There's a little bit of excitement of getting to see uh, what I consider a second family every year. Uh, and, and I would say it's, it's very unique to have a residency class get together this often. And this year, their annual Super Bowl reunion will be in Tampa Bay at Super Bowl 55. I um, got an email that actually physically had my ticket this morning, so that was just a whole new level of, okay, this actually is real. And actually seeing, you know, just the, the chatter amongst our friends and the happiness that we're all the, we're just like through the moon. They won free tickets to the game. Their story catching the attention of the NFL after the league announced it would invite 7,500 vaccinated healthcare workers to the Super Bowl, thanking and honoring them for their service during the pandemic. Having um, this bright spot where, you know, I, I, I can say that I've just been, you know, thinking about being with my friends and being at the Super Bowl. It's, it's just added a lightness um, that is much, much needed, you know, after the year that we've been through. The NFL is taking precautions for the game amid the pandemic, and these doctors are too. We don't plan on getting too crazy uh, in Tampa. We're going to we're going to stick together, wear a mask, social distance, even e even though we are vaccinated. These doctors just thankful their reunion can continue. We get excited about hanging out together, and this is just going to be sort of icing on the cake to be able to do that at the Super Bowl. The group scoring a touchdown with tickets to the biggest game of the season. Kendall Morris, WCNC Charlotte.